from NBC News, this is Today. Yeah. Up next, the queen of the big fat wedding. Yes, the big fat Greek wedding. <laughs> oh, yeah, she, she's got this terrific adoption project. We're going to talk to Nia Vardalos right after this. Writer, actress, and director Nia Vardalos is probably best known for her smash hit, My Big Fat Greek Wedding. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what happens. First comes love, then comes marriage, and yes, finally, the kids. All right. While Nia didn't marry her on-screen love interest, she did marry fellow actor Ian Gomez, and together they adopted a beautiful little girl. Now Nia is proud to be a spokesperson for National Adoption Day and is encouraging others to consider the same option. Adoption? So nice Hello, to Miss see you. Nia. Hi, Mrs. Guys. Velt, looking oh, yes. sensational. <laughs> What's Thank going you. on here? Did you well, lose a lot um, of weight? I was di uh, diagnosed with a blood sugar issue, uh -huh. and um, I had to lose weight, uh -huh. and that was a bit of a bummer because nobody likes to be told what to do. But in the end, it was the the healthy thing to do. I had to um, put the Doritos down. Oh, is that your is that your downfall, Doritos? Yeah, the kind with the uh, which the kind? Ranch. The, the, yes. Oh. Cool ranch. Yes. Oh, yeah. cool ranch you oh, yeah. do. I could crumble those on, you know, Put lettuce. Put on cereal. Yeah, yeah. anything. Hey, yeah. We were talking about airbrushing. Are you, do you think that that's an okay thing to Should do? Should we airbrush Would you... babies? Babies, no. Yes, not babies. If you can't accept a baby the way it looks, there's yeah. something wrong with You've you. You've got problems. Yeah. What about grown-ups? Grown-ups, um, yeah, I wish there was like somebody. I th you remember that Vaseline screen they used to do? Yes. Oh, I love those. I yeah. love that. Yeah, We're on HD TV right now. Yes. Isn't, that, oh, isn't right. that fun to know that's they can brutal. see into every pore? Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Adoption. Don't look my nose. <laughs> adoption was something that, that you thought about, and you most parents want a, a newborn. That's really what parents want. But that wasn't what happened with you, was it? Well, we were on many lists, mm -hmm. and I do support the uh, the woman who gives birth. I support the right to change their mind. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. That's their God-given right. And so it had fallen through a couple of times for mm -hmm. us. And it was heartbreaking. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. It dis uh, disappointment after disappointment. But, you know, all these wonderful things had happened to me with my big fat Greek wedding, and then I couldn't mm -hmm. figure out why it wasn't happening this way. And so mm -hmm. then I met with these women at a foster family agency who told us that there are 129,000 kids legally free for adoption in this mm. country. And I said, well, why don't I know this? I don't understand it. Because that's they, another option for people. Yeah. yeah. And, and they, you could fall in love with the child. Exactly. And they said, well, we don't have the money to advertise. We don't have a spokesperson. And, you know, my husband and I are very private people, which is why we don't allow our daughter's face to be shown mm -hmm. and her name to be publicized. And the more I thought about it, I thought, I want to go out there and just debunk the myths mm -hmm. about foster care mm -hmm. and just tell people that it worked for us. It was it's nine months. It's absolutely free. It's open to. What do it you mean it's nine months? It was sweetie? for us. It was yeah. a nine month process. Foster. 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 Yeah, I recommend using a foster family agency. And the way to do it is go to your website, and I've um, supplied all the websites. Yeah. Uh, Childwelfare.gov uh -huh. forward slash well, NFCAD. I, I think people might be nervous about foster families because you're not sure what the backstory yeah. is 100 percent and you're worried that you might get a kid who who's had a lot of you know emotional physical issues and That's things right. like medical you don't know yeah. what their dna know. is yeah. well here in america yeah. we have to have full disclosure so you absolutely must be told everything about their history mm -hmm. that's the beautiful thing mm -hmm. and uh, they will never ask you to take on a situation that you're not emotionally or physically equipped to take on mm -hmm. there are kids our daughter has no emotional or physical abuse yeah. in her background and some of these kids of course do yeah. but your social workers mm -hmm. the, who I call the super pretty angels <laughs> will help to guide you to the child that they feel that you are the best match uh -huh. for. How old was your daughter when you adopted her? She was three years old when she, she walked was in three. her door. Wow. And yeah. what was that first moment yeah. like for you guys? You know, Kathy, when I first saw her, I had a feeling of, oh, I found you. Just like that. Oh, it wow. was very strange. And um, you do like a mm. chemistry meet. So it was in the offices, lots of social workers, all, a lot of people around us. And we just kept looking at each other. Mm. And I, I knew she was, you know, again, legally free for adoption. Mm -hmm. That's another myth that, that a child cannot be placed in your home and then taken away. Yeah. That's not what's going to happen. Deal, right? So I knew all this, but I didn't know if we were going to be matched with her. Mm -hmm. And they put her in the car and they were taking her away. And I was looking at her and trying to have brave face. Yeah. And then she just turned to me and she went, Bye, Mommy. <gasps> okay. Stop it. Okay. So she knew what that was she all knew. about. She oh, great, my God. God. <laughs> You're a terrific spokesperson. Oh, for my gosh. <laughs> That's so great. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so <laughs> much for <laughs> sharing <laughs> that. <story. laughs> all right. For more oh, information so on great. foster care adoption, you can visit our website at klgandhoda.com.